Hey guys, Ken's Restricted coming at you. So, sorry, this is like laryngitis or something crazy. Um, drink more water. Anyway, so, I don't know if you saw the title of this video. It's up there. Yes, I'm pregnant. Yay! Um, I'm really happy. I'm super excited. I'm scared shitless, but super excited nonetheless. Uh, Louise and I have been not preventing uh, for, I don't know, maybe three weeks? No, 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 that's not true. Three months. Three ones. Um, I don't know. I, I, I never had my period, ever, before. Um, you know, as you know, I went months and months with not having a period, having a period. It was very irregular. Um, so my last menstrual was the 12th of October. So according to all of my research thus far, um, I, uh, da, 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 I'm 12 weeks, I'm four, can't even think, I'm six weeks in like four days, um, I don't really know how that whole calculation comes about. Um, I do know that I should be due somewhere like mid-July, so cancer baby. <laughs> my, uh, my dad is a cancer, so I know all about cancers. Um, so that will be interesting. Louise and I are both... Um, I'm not really, really into astrology, but, you know, I definitely think that I am my zodiac sign, so, um, Louise and I are both earth signs, so we will have a water sign baby, so, that'll be an interesting mix of personalities, for sure. Um, so, six, six weeks, I don't know, that's kind of, like, freaks me out. Um, I told my, okay, so, legit, I just found out yesterday, so don't be thinking I, like, been to the doctor and, no. Uh, you know I gotta come on and tell you guys I'm a business. Um, so found out yesterday. Actually, kind of like, you know, they say that you just know. Um, on Monday, last week, um, Louise and I went to the gym. And <coughs> so we went to the gym and I got on the treadmill. And I ran like legit like half a mile. And my boobs hurt so bad that I had to like stop. I mean, I had to get off the treadmill because it hurt so bad. And then on Tuesday when I like went to put my bra on in the morning, I like flinched. And um, when I was on the treadmill, my mother's voice just like popped into my head as soon as that happened. Um, it was like, I don't know when it was, it must have been a long time ago, but she said, I know I knew I was pregnant with Mackenzie when my boobs started hurting. Um, because with my brother, her first child, she, you know, she'd never been pregnant before. She just didn't know what to expect. You know, she had no idea. She was the first sibling um, in our family to have a baby. So no one had had any, you know, prior experiences to really tell her about. And so when, you know, my boobs were hurting when I was running, I just thought, oh, wow, that's weird. Um, and I kind of just chopped it up and left it at that. Well, as it continued to, like, progress through the week, I kind of started having this, like, okay, mm, yeah, something's definitely going on. And, because I thought, oh, I'll start my period. Well, my period was already late, um, basically on Monday, because I should have started on Sunday, the 12th. So, I got through Thanksgiving, had a fantastic time with my family, um, honestly kind of joked about being pregnant at Thanksgiving, and, um, <laughs> didn't know that I was. Um, yeah, and then as soon as you find out, you know, you, like, go back to, like, oh, my God, what did I do? I, like, was probably not, you know, the best person. <laughs> um, I have had a few glasses of wine since being pregnant, so, yeah, Rosemary, uh, Jessica, at your wedding, I would have been pregnant, so I definitely indulged that night. Um, but anyhow, I am super excited. Um, of course, I had to go buy a new journal, and well, I've been writing in it every day, you know. Uh, I definitely have that, like, oh, I'm in love feeling. Um, I, I'm excited to have kids. I mean, no, I'm excited to have a kid. Um, I only want one child, so, uh, I don't know. My cousin jokes saying she's going to have three so she can give me an extra one uh, because she doesn't <laughs> want me to have just one spoiled child, but that's sort of what I've always wanted, so I don't know. We'll see. I'm not even going there yet. Um... I have, I do have a, an appointment with a doctor on this coming Friday. 
I actually uh, just already had that appointment to get uh, just like my regular wellness yearly pap smear, all of that jazz. Um, I guess we won't be doing that this time, so that'll be interesting. Um, 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 I gotta figure out a few things, uh, insurance. Uh, I am a dependent on my mother's insurance, and so I fear that I will not have coverage for my pregnancy because of that. So, yeah, I'm a little bit nervous about that. I know that there are things that I can, um, you know, th things through the state or getting on insurance that's offered through my job. Um, but I don't know. I don't know if I'm considered a pre-existing. I don't know anything. <laughs> I don't know anything. Um, I just know that I'm really happy and... Um, Louise and I are still sort of in that, like, processing it area now. He hasn't told his mother yet, so uh, he will do that tomorrow. I have a couple of people left in my family that I haven't told. And, uh, yeah, other than that, um, everyone's happy. I'm happy. Uh, this will be my mother's fourth grandchild and my father's second. Uh, my parents are divorced, so... Uh, yeah, so I'm really, really, I'm really, really excited. Uh, I guess I can, I don't know, who do I want to start doing those, showing you my stomach? It looks the same, how about that? You saw it a couple of weeks ago. It looks the same. Um, I did, oh gosh, um, my weight for this week, I'm up another four pounds, which terrifies me, basically. Um, <laughs> I, uh, I can't. I can't get my weight back being pregnant. That's a, not an option. So, um, I'm going to give myself, like, a range, you know, 165 to 170. If I see more than 173, I'm probably going to wig out. So, I'm going to say 165 to 173 is really where I would like to stay. I want to get back down into the 165 during the first trimester if I can. Um, so, yeah, I'm very excited. Uh, I hope all of you had a great week. Um, Louise and I have decided five days a week at the gym should be good. Um, I'm going to continue to, to jog. I'm, I'm not scared of that, um, in any way. I'm going to continue my workout going as hard and strong as I ever have. Um, I've obviously been doing it for the first six weeks, so, not that, not to say that I haven't gained weight, because I have, but, um, I'm not... Con I'm not really concerned with that. I know there are millions of people out there that have run, you know, that are runners, that, um, you know, work out and train and do strenuous workouts during pregnancy, so not worried about that. Anyways, I'm going to let you guys go. I hope everybody has a great Saturday night. I'm chilling at home. We had pizza, and I had, like, half a slice of pizza and, like, maybe four uh, buffalo wings, so... I'm good and I'm going to drink my water and I'll talk to you guys later. Love you, bye.